Hello guys, this is Aladdin and today we are tackling the greatest common divisor of an infinite sequence 2002 plus 2, 2002 squared plus 2, 2002 to the power of 3 plus 2 and so on but don't stress, we've got the make it easier strategy which is like having a cheat code for math if you did not see my video about the make it easier strategy, you will find the link down below in the description. Please take some time to think about the problem on your own. Let's now jump into it. Here are the steps I'll be guiding you through, so pause the video and take them as a hint if you wish. The make it easier strategy consists of solving an easier version of the problem and then going back to the original one. So what might be an easier version of this problem? Let's try to compute the greatest common divisor of just the first two terms. Let's call it G1. What do you think G1 might be? I don't know. To find G1, we'll use the Euclidean algorithm. This mathematical algorithm states that the greatest common divisor of A and B is equal to the greatest common divisor of A and B and the remainder when b is divided by a. So the next step is to divide 2002 squared plus 2 by 2002 plus 2, which rewrites as follows. Do not hesitate to pause the video and verify this equality. As we can see, the remainder here is 6. So g1, which is originally equal to the greatest common divisor of 2002 plus 2 and 2002 squared plus 2, is equal to the greatest common divisor of 2002 plus 2, which is 2004 and 6, which is equal to 6. This is how we have solved the easier version of the problem. Let's go to the original one, shall we? Take a moment to think about this. Does G divide G1 or does G1 divide G? Intuitively speaking, there actually are more constraints on G than on G1 because G divides an infinite number of terms, but G1 only divides the first two integers in the sequence. So G divides G1, which is 6. Let's see if G1 is actually equal to 6 or not. 6 is equal to 3 times 2. But all of the terms in our sequence are divisible by 2 because they are even. What about 3? 2002 is congruent to 1 mod 3. 2002 to the power of k is congruent to 1 to the power of k mod 3, which is 1. Eventually, 2002 to the power of k plus 2 is congruent to 1 plus 2 mod 3, which is 0 mod 3. Since 2 divides all terms in our sequence, 2 divides g, same goes for 3. Since 2 and 3 are co-primes, 2 times 3, which is 6, divides g. Eventually, since g divides 6 and 6 divides g, and g is positive, g equals 6. This is it, guys. How did you find this exercise? Here is another exercise for you to keep progressing. Find the solution in the link below in the description on my Instagram account. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video. Goodbye.